lasting images of a comprehensive performance by UCLA just off their season high flirting with 198 and the Olympian Jordan Childs a big part of it Jordan if you're not aware you went 3985 today new personal best congratulations how'd you feel about your performance honestly I have no words right now. I think I just wanted to come out here and do another big one for my team. You know, I'm all about the team right now, not really focusing on individual or anything like that. So knowing that I've got another personal best of at such a high all-around score is an amazing thing. I'm really excited and can't wait to look forward to the next competition. Okay, near perfect scores on vault and bars. I gave you a perfect 10 on beam. I mean, what do you think it's gonna take to get a 10 out of one of your routines? Honestly, I really don't know. I'm just focusing on what I know best and it's just always being myself and just going out there and having fun and whether or not they give it or don't give it, I'm just really proud of myself that I hit the event. Well, your gymnastics was incredible tonight. So fun to watch, but the beam lineup last week, you made a huge comeback there and a repeat performance across the board. How impressed and how important do you think this beam lineup is as you go into the postseason? I think honestly, it all comes down to the trust part of it. We trust each one, like each one of us going into it, starting from our first person, Emily Lee, all the way to Emma Malabuyo. So knowing that I'm in the mix of that is definitely a huge thing. We've worked really, really hard in the gym and I couldn't be more proud of what they've done in the gym and obviously putting it out onto the competition floor. So it's gonna be a big one knowing that we can do it so many times in a row and can't wait for postseason to be fun. You've reminded us it's not about you. It's about the team. But <laughs> yes. because I posed this question to your Olympic teammate and good friend Jade Carey yes. at Stanford on Friday when she went 39.875, mm -hmm. she said she has thought about going a perfect 40. <laughs> has that thought entered your mind? It, do it does all the time. You know, it's really hard knowing whether or not you're going to come into the gym and be like, okay, I'm gonna hit a perfect 40, but I think it all just comes down to how you perform that day and whether or not it shows with the scores or not, you know, as long as you come back proud and be who you are. I mean, of course it'd be amazing to get a perfect 40, but I don't know if, you know, it, everything happens for a reason. So I'm just waiting for that moment. Well, it hasn't happened since 1996. It's been a minute. <laughs> yes, we yes. always <laughs> appreciate your time and your insights. Congratulations on another magnificent day. Thank you guys so much. Thank the you. Olympian, the All-American, Jordan Charles, part of another